Welcome to the plus advanced tutorials. Today I gonna demonstrate carousel remote, which is the one of the unique element of the plus addons for the elementor. The basic function for the carousel remote is to make a remote which manage any switch or the carousel option. For example, you can see these are the options. And this will work with the blog post, testimonials, WooCommerce products, client logos, image galleries, team members, anything carousels, and the switches and other options. Like for example, we have put the blog carousel over here, and you can manage that from the anywhere with this kind of option. This is the testimonial, which also you can manage from here. This one is the team members. So you can manage any carousel using this switcher which we call carousel remote. Now let's go to the carousel remote options. The most important part of the carousel remote is unique connection ID. That means you need to put the unique value over here in the switcher as well as the part you want to connect. For example here in the switcher switcher widget you have the option of the connection over here which is called unique switcher id you just need to match this value with the remote's value once you match this your remote will be connected with this option and it will start working the same will be available for the anything like for example in the product section You have the option in the carousel option unique carousel id you just need to put the unique id over here and you just need to connect it but make sure this id should be unique now let's get back to the option of the remote once you select the unique id you need to select the carousel or the switcher because both have the different functionalities you need to select one of them then you have the text option for the both the buttons you also have the alignment options you have the icon style options available you also select the custom so from the custom you can add any image and if you want the normal style you can keep this now if you want to select the icon here is the icon and you can adjust the icon space but if you doesn't want the icon you just make this zero so it will be a hidden and if you want to keep that you also have the normal and active color options now let's go to the button style option in the button style option you have all the available options like button gap so you can adjust the gap between those then you have the padding option you have the typography options you have the text color box border and those all options are for the normal and the for the hover condition then you also have the border border width radius you also have the background options the box head options all those available for the normal and the hover condition then you have the on scroll view animation option we have made separate video for this you can check it out on our channel so these are the options which are available in the carousel remote hope you have enjoyed this video tutorial on carousel remote if you have any other questions write us on the comment box below subscribe to our channel for more video tutorials like this check all the links related in the description below thanks for watching and keep crafting amazing websites See you in the next video.